Hello and welcome to Let's Play The Evil Within 2. What? I didn't know this was open. Hold up. So I first came in from. Okay, I can't leave. Yeah, a long time ago I thought that that guy that was outside was the guy who had the machine gun, but my geography was horrible at the time, and no, it was not. As you can see, I have taken damage because I have been sweeping the streets of infested um, enemies you guys have seen already. I just took them out. I haven't seen anything new. Um, actually, I did see a house that I didn't go into, but I'm about to go in there now with you guys because I wasn't about to explore it by myself. Oh, no. That was not going to happen. <sighs> Why is that gun that gun? Okay, here we go. So yeah, there's an enemy in this house. There's something in this house with the enemy. I don't know what it is. But why do I feel like I've been here before already? Yeah, I have been in here before, haven't I? The only reason I would go in here is for the XP, I guess. To get the kills. This is weird because I could have swore I killed everything here. Um. Well, this gives us a good chance to try these out. How are they alive? Oh! I was going to use another one on both of them, but um I guess I didn't retrace my I mean replace my bolt. Oh god. You can't see me, I'm one with the bush. That, um... That bothers me a little bit that that explosive bolt didn't really do much. I thought it would have killed one of them at the very least. It didn't. Unless there were more enemies there. Maybe there was. I don't know. Don't know what that was about. I don't want her going back in there, though. Stay right there, yes. Perfect. She got a face on her back. I have seen it before, but I never commented on it. That's creepy as all hell. This guy's still stalking the halls. If he's feasting alone this time, 
Um, that'll be awesome. All right, cool. Oh yeah, it was just the two of them. I don't understand that. We surely have been in here already, right? I've been in here. Yeah. Unless all the houses look the same. Let me just make sure. I don't want to be wrong. Yeah, had to. Yeah, I remember this. This is the armory. Yeah. Alright. Weird that enemies would go back there. Uh, Off screen, I saw that ghost... Well, I saw that walker running again. Well, I guess they're not walkers if they're running, right? Oh, God! That was probably the best jump scare so far in this game. I gotta give him that one. That was a good one. I like that. I like that. What I'm gonna do now. I have contemplated opening that truck. I'm trying to see how many of those guys I could take out. I'm fairly confident I can kill them now with my upgraded uh, arsenal here, but at the same time. Have I been in this house? Yeah, I've been here, okay. At the same time, I don't wanna waste ammo. I just wasted ammo, I didn't really like that too much. Did not like it. Just making sure I've got everything here. Okay, that's why the truck was shaking last time. I'll take it. I will take it. That thing is so broken. That stealth kill thing is broken, so I'm glad I got it. I'm glad I got it early game. Very good. Okay, now I'm I am approaching uh, unknown territory here, and I bet when I take this, you're gonna wake up, aren't you? Are you not? You are now, though. What the hell? Can I kill you? Whoa! Perfect view of the cunt. That was so weird. She wasn't reacting to the initial swing. Or, uh, swings. Plural. But then when I, uh, decapitate... When I took the arm off, she, uh... That's when she wanted to get frisky. And she's just gonna stand there? She's just gonna fucking stand there. Can I get the kill? Wow, how you doing? I sure you know what? Well, 
Well, I feel like she's trying. Oh, she can't come behind me. she go she behind me <laughs> oh she jumped over she did she actually did oh god why do you stop running guy why? No, I don't want to be up here. Out of the corner, come on. If I'm not holding the R1, he should not be in cover, but he was. I don't get that. <sighs> this game builds anxiety. It really does. So what you gonna do with it, buddy? You just gonna stand there? Yeah, come over here. Gotcha. Such a useful tactic. I rec I highly recommend that you build your stealth up. Um Let that be the first thing. What the fuck? Let that be the first thing that you do if you play on nightmare mode. I don't know how the normal mode is, but if you're playing nightmare mode, stealth is definitely the way to go. Another one of those creatures. Well, I know there's a safe house nearby. I definitely want to get to that. Give me a second. And this place is riddled with enemies. Um, where's the safe house? That's that's my main priority right now. It's past this. As long as I don't attract any unwanted attention, I should be okay. I have a great feeling if I pick whatever he's holding up, that's going to trigger thy NMI. I know exactly what to do here.
They ask you to go into work tomorrow, even though you said you needed hours, and you do this. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Meme reference. Homer Simpson. Come on, people. Can I actually just, like, walk through that? And, uh, but then that means he can't either, so I'm not mad at it. Yoink. Anything under these cars? <sighs> okay. Where is he going? Where the fuck is he going? Okay, bye. Whatever. See you on the flip side, buddy. Now, before I was so rudely interrupted. Just make sure he doesn't try any sneaky shit. Someone thinks something's funny, and I don't. At the all. Can I go in here? He said it's locked. Please don't be. Okay, nice. Uh, safe spot. Go to the Morrow Operations. Got the coffee station. This is good stuff. Good stuff. Got a mirror. Recruitment in Moose Centers. The number of applicants received through the Moose Centers have surpassed that of the medical testing front. Registering the Moose Centers as a tax-free religious institution has increased revenue, which we've used to render expansions to accommodate the influx of new recruits. Mr. Wallace's... Use of neuro-linguistic programming creates recruits that are far more mentally malleable and stable than previous STEM candidates. Moose Center recruits are also willing to voluntarily cut off familial ties, which eases the pressure on Mobius operatives working in law enforcement. No more pesky missing persons reports to file. It is my recommendation that Moose Center recruitment becomes the Mobius standard for all new citizens. It has been a resounding success. Well then. Well then. I don't consider this Mobius shit successful. Smoke Bolt. This crossbow bolt releases a cloud of smoke centered around its impact point. Sometimes stealth is better option than fighting. It's easier to escape or sneak kill when enemies can't see you. Upgrading your smoke bolts at a workbench can give you the ability to sneak kill enemies trapped inside the area of effect. Smoke bolts can be crafted by combining smoke powder and gunpowder. Well, that's where the smoke powder is coming in. I have plenty of it. Gunpowder, not so much. This gunpowder seems to be the standard for any crafting tool. Uh, speaking of crafting, where's the workbench? I don't see it.
I guess there's one in the mirror, yeah, but yeah, makes sense. Um, do I need to go to a workbench right now? I don't know. Let's save. Got two save files. I don't think I need more than that. I'm pretty. I'm doing pretty good. I'm happy with where I am with it. Uh, the, the health. I'm not gonna use that coffee unless I'm red health bar. Could I level up? Um, I don't even know how much I have. I have three thousand. No, I cannot. I'm gonna check this out. Let's see what this. Looks like it's locked by some sort of password. I'm not gonna check this out. We need a password, and you know what I think? I think that that Mobius guy who tried to kill me when I came in here, I think he has that password. He ran off, though. That is what he did. Well, let's take some of these enemies out. Shit. You didn't see me. Above me, woman. Because you're not to the side of me. Oh, God! Give up, bitch! I'm not your flavor. You can't be serious. Oh, she fucked up. Alright, I got her. Here we go. Why do I hear another enemy? Surely there's something in this truck, bro. Right? Maybe no. Maybe no. Who am I hearing? Is it the Mobius dude? No, he didn't. I don't give up. This way, baby. This way, Benteaki. No, I said this way. Where is she going? It's not what I need you to do at all, woman. What the? Why did they just run off like this? I, I don't get it. Like, where? What?
Okay. So strange. Can I search this? Got a lot of gunpowder. Let's wake this guy up. Oh. If it doesn't give it to me by a certain point, then I pretty much am not going to be going for it. Turn around, please. Go the other way. <laughs> you tried to do me dirty. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Shotgun shells and then give me those enemies. No. Did I just. I just killed him, right? You're alive. Um, now there's those two in the back of the house. I'm gonna save again because I want to try something on this guy. Why does he keep switching my gun? I don't know why he keeps doing that, but I want to try to stealth kill that guy. You know what I'm actually gonna do? I'm actually going to go here. Um, yeah, let me level up and all that stuff and then save. I'll let you guys watch just so you can see how I'm doing this. If you're playing along with me, please do. Uh, nah, but feel free. Um, Let's make some sniper rifle bullets. That leaves me with six. I'm full on shotgun, so I don't need that. I think I'll make a smoke. Uh, I think I'll save the rest. Let's check weapon upgrades. I've got 65 parts and... Um, I don't think that's a lot. Yeah. Uh, it's not a lot for what I need, but let's check what Smoke Bolt needs. A hundred for the duration. 
Let's use it first before we decide what... If it's worth investing in. I think it will be. Since it's a stealth-friendly upgrade. Hmm. Not looking so good. Let me help you. Oh, you know how to help me. I know you do. Uh, let's see what the athleticism has to offer. I can't do that. Actually, I might not even be able to upgrade anything here. That's pretty cool. Alright, so I guess we're gonna scrap that idea. Um, since I don't have much. Let me save one more time, and I think I'm gonna call that an episode. Cats meowing. Uh, alright. That's been Let's Play Evil Within 2. We've got a daring the one up, man. Thank you for watching. Hope you all have a great day. Goodbye.